Good morning. It is a beautiful early spring day up here in upstate New York. My name is Barb Malera and I'm part of the team at Harvesting History, an upstate New York heirloom horticultural company. Today we're going to talk about planting lettuce, one of the very first crops that you plant in the spring. But before we do that, we're going to give you a teeny tiny primer on the different kinds of lettuce so that you can make good choices for yourself. The first lettuce, and in terms of the type of lettuce, the hardiest of the lettuces that we have are the romaine lettuces. Now we're all worried this week, it's, uh, it's April of 2018 and uh, they pulled all the romaines from a lot of the shelves in the grocery store because everybody's worried about E. coli. Well, you won't have to worry about E. coli if you're growing your own romaine lettuce. So let's talk briefly about it. Again, it is the most cold hardy of all the lettuce types that we have available to grow. It is, in my opinion, best harvested as baby romaine. This is not baby romaine. This is the fully mature head romaine. But if I were you, I'd grow the romaine for baby romaine and be happy with that. The second kind of lettuce that is very, very hardy are the red leaf lettuces. Uh, this particular one is, um, looks like red sails to me, an extremely cold hardy leaf lettuce. The way you harvest leaf lettuces is you take leaves from the outside and eat the individual leaves and work your way into the center as the season goes on. The red lettuces, no matter what kind, whether it's romaine or leaf or any other kind, are the hardiest of the different colored lettuces. So this is a leaf lettuce. Then we get to everybody's favorite. This is iceberg lettuce, unmistakable. Every steakhouse in the world gives you half a head of iceberg lettuce with a whole bunch of chunky blue cheese dressing and some bacon and you're in heaven. These, this is called a crisp head lettuce. It is nowhere near as cold hardy as the other two lettuces that we just discussed. And finally, the most fragile, but she is the most elegant of the lettuces, are the butterhead lettuces. They are fragile, but their sweet, fresh leaves are just absolutely delicious. You harvest this as you would with the iceberg lettuce, you harvest the entire head. You don't take the leaves off, you harvest the entire head. And this is uh, one of the two most famous of all butterhead lettuces. This is Butter Crunch. The other one that you will probably see in the grocery store is called Boston or White Boston lettuce. So that does it for your little primer on lettuces. Okay, you survived the primer on lettuce. Now let's get down to the real business of actually planting. To plant lettuce, it just doesn't get any easier than in gardening than to plant lettuce. Start early in the spring. Uh, you don't really have to be that worried about a few more frosts happening after you have planted the lettuce. The lettuce in the spring will take about 14 to 21 days to actually germinate unless for some reason your soil has gotten very warm very fast. But lettuce in the spring likes cold soil. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a tool. This is my go-to tool. I love this tool. It's called a hori. It's a Japanese uh, gardening knife, and I now use it for everything. So right now it's working as a trowel, and I'm just making a very, very shallow row. And then I'm going to take my seed Can you actually get in close enough to see the seed? One thing about lettuce is it's at least a two season crop. So we're gonna be back at you again in July reminding you that you can begin a fall crop of lettuce. I've sprinkled the seed and now I'm just gonna gently 
pull some soil over that seed. There's nothing magical about it. You don't have to come out here with a ruler and make sure that the seed is exactly a quarter of an inch deep. Don't worry about that. Okay, and then just pat the soil down. Mostly you're patting the soil down so that the critters don't dig into the soil to get the seed. The lettuce seed is so little they often just leave it alone. That's all you have to do. In the spring, if you plant early enough, you don't even have to moisten the soil after you've planted it because the soil from the winter is already moist. But if your soil has begun to dry out, then what you want to do is take a hose and just gently sprinkle water all along the row where you have the lettuce. I hope you've enjoyed this little talk about planting lettuce. I would suggest that you go to our website, www.harvesting-history.com and look at some of our fantastic heirloom lettuce collection. In terms of romaine, I highly, highly recommend Cimarron. It's probably the greatest and hardiest and most cold tolerant of the lettuces, the romaine lettuces that we offer. In terms of the leaf lettuces, I heartily recommend red oak leaf. Again, an incredibly hardy leaf lettuce. I already told you that butter crunch is probably the most famous and most widely grown of the, the butterhead lettuces. And iceberg is iceberg is iceberg. Have a good day, plant away.